Hello, this is Steve from the Fluorescent Flying Penguins. Today I'm going to be talking about the logic operations block and what it does. What the logic operations block does is it allows you to take two logic answers and compare them against each other to make another answer depending on which setting you have it on. The settings are AND, OR, XOR, and NOT. Okay, so now I'm going to explain all of them to you and what they do. The first one, AND, what it does is it asks if both A and B are true. If they are, then it gives out an answer that says true. If not, it gives out an answer that's false. So, let's take two logic constant blocks and plug them in. So first, let's make them both true to see what happens. Yes. As you could hear, it said yes because they're both true. If I change one of them to false and then download and run, no. as you could hear, it said no because it the, it didn't give out a true reading. Okay, so the next setting after that is called OR. What OR does is it asks if either A or B is true. If either one of them is true, it gives out a reading that says true. If neither of them are true, then it gives out a reading that says false. So, theoretically, if I change this to OR, this should say yes. Let's download and run it. Yes. As you could hear, it's played yes because be because one of them is true. So let's see what happens if they're both true. Yes. Said yes because still one of them was true. But if we make them both false, then no. as you could hear, it didn't say yes because they were both false, so it gave out a false reading. Okay, so the next setting after that is called XOR. What that does is it asks if only one of them is true. So, this should say no, so let's test it. No. As you can hear, it said no because neither one of them was true. What if we make them both true? No. It said no because both of them were true. But if we make it only one true, then it's going to work, because this only works when either one of them is true. It can't be both, or it can't be none. Yes. As you can see, it said yes, because only one of them was true. Okay, so the last setting on the logic operations block is called NOT. What NOT does is it asks if A is false. If A is false, then it says that it sends out a signal that says true. If A is true, it sends out a signal that's false. So let's test this. This should say true. Yes. As you can hear, it said yes because it was A was said as false. But if we change it over to true, it's not going to work because A is is it false? No. Thank you for watching this episode of Programming with EV3. Thank you and goodbye.